the Cordat 15 is an Iranian design and domestically produced surface to MSR system and there on June 9, 2019. Developed by the Iranian Aviation Industries Organization, the system represents a significant milestone in Iran's defense strategy, particularly in countering aerial threats from regional and extra-regional actors. Its unveiling came at a time of escalating tensions with the United States and amidst growing uncertainties surrounding the 2015 Iran nuclear deal, officially known as the Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action. The Cordat 15 air defense system is engineered to detect and engage a wide spectrum of aerial threats, including fighter jets, stealth targets, unmanned combat area vehicles, and cruise missiles. It offers a detection range of up to 150 km for conventional aircraft and 80 km for stealth targets with a tracking range of 120 km. Its engagement range extends to 75 km for conventional targets and 45 km for stealth targets, where its operational altitude up to 27 km. Notably, the system can simultaneously track and engage up to six targets, enabling it to handle coordinated area attacks effectively. Additionally, it boasts a rapid deployment time of less than five minutes, allowing for a swift response to emerging threats. The system operates in conjunction with Sayat-3 missiles, designed for medium to long-range engagements. These missiles significantly enhance the platform's ability to neutralize advanced aerial threats, including modern fighter aircraft and high-altitude surveillance systems. The Cordat 15's mobility and swift deployment capabilities make it a versatile and essential component of Iran's Layer Air Defense Network. In December 2024, reports confirmed the deployment of Cordat 15 systems near key Iranian nuclear facilities, particularly around the Shahid Ahmadi Russia nuclear site in Natanz, located in East Fahan province. This site is central to Iran's uranium enrichment efforts and has been a focal point of international scrutiny. The deployment underscores Iran's intent to protect its critical infrastructure from potential Israeli or U.S. air strikes. The move to position called at 15 systems near sensitive facilities reflects heightened threats from both Israel and the United States. Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has repeatedly stated that Israel would not allow Iran to develop nuclear weapons, with military officers reportedly preparing operational plans for strikes on Iranian facilities. While the Biden administration has prioritized diplomatic efforts to revive the JCPOA, the possibility of military action remains on the table. By fortifying key sites with Cordat 15 systems, Iran seeks to deter and, if necessary, counter preemptive strikes aimed at its nuclear infrastructure. Since its introduction in 2019, the Cordat 15 has been central to Iran's strategy for safeguarding its airspace against increasingly sophisticated threats. Though exact operational engagements remain undisclosed, the system is likely integrated into Iran's broader air defense network, which includes systems like the Bavar 373 and S-300, 
this deployment highlights Iran's emphasis on self-reliance in defense technology, especially under international sanctions. The Core that 15's advanced capabilities position it as a key asset in defending against a variety of threats against Israeli air strikes targeting Iranian infrastructure or ally forces in Syria. The system's ability to track and intercept multiple targets simultaneously provides a critical defensive advantage. It is also well suited for countering U.S. reconnaissance missions and drone operations that often prove Iranian airspace, leveraging its rapid deployment and long-range tracking to neutralize these threats effectively. Furthermore, the system's ability to engage stealth aircraft and low-flying cruise missiles enables it to address coordinated aerial assaults that employ diverse and technologically advanced platforms. Together, these capabilities solidify the Kordat 15's role as the cornerstone of Iran's air defense strategy. The Kordat 15 is frequently compared to other regional air defense systems, such as Israel's Iron Dome and Davis Sling, as well as Saudi Arabia's Patriot Pack 3 and THAAD systems. While each system is tailored to specific threats, the core that 15 strengths and limitations are evident in this context. Unlike regional systems reliant on foreign procurement, the core that 15 exemplifies Iran's ability to develop advanced military technology domestically. Its ability to detect and intercept stealth targets within 85 km range provides a critical advantage against 5th generation aircraft like the F-35. With a setup time of under 5 minutes, the system is highly adaptable to dynamic threat environments. The core at 15's 75 km engagement range is shorter than systems like the S-400 with 400 km or a THAAD with 200 km for ballistic missile threats. Iran's reliance on multiple standalone systems may complicate seamless operational integration compared to Israel's highly networked air defense. While systems like the Iron Dome have demonstrated consistent success in live combat scenarios, the core that 15's performance under real world conditions remains largely untested. The core that 15 plays a critical role in Iran's asymmetric defense strategy, 